my name is Creative Delirium. Hi, and welcome back to my channel, and welcome to my channel if you're new here. I still have two videos to pre-film. But, I just got off work, and a package had arrived. Now, I'm gonna hold it up from the wrong side. Um, yeah, it, like, I love the font. Sent with love from the UK. Um, which tells me that this is probably my witchcraft, witch casket box, even though I have three boxes coming from the UK every month. So, here we go. Yep, it is definitely witch casket. Okay? Now, I did spoil myself a bit. I looked at the customs declaration. Um, but I haven't looked inside. Just took the film off now. Um, so this is the January box for 2024. Okay, okay. So I see a lot of people, like, open it where the camera can see. I guess I should do that. I guess I should do it, like, in a real influencer way. So then we can look together. Um, just, just a letter on top. So let's start with that. Okay, so this is the Magic Rituals. Feature our highlights. This is the first time that I'm opening one, so bear with me if it takes a little bit long. Um, oh, cool. So they do marketing stuff. Oh, I should probably stop flipping through this since this is a bit of a spoiler. But overall, like this... This is very, very gorgeous. I love it so far. Oh my god, oh my god, okay. Okay. Okay, so this is a monthly manifestation on the little back of this little, you know. It's just a little monthly manifestation on this cute little witchy print. Okay. Oh my, oh shh. Okay, okay. Book of Rituals. Oh. Oh, this is so perfect. Okay. Okay. It's this cute little book. It says Book of Rituals. And it has little different things. And it... I think it actually... Well, it is just one thing. But it repeats throughout it. It's got this cute little inlay. I'm very happy to have this. Like, this is small enough that I can legitimately carry this with me. I'll wait for this uh, for just a moment. Because this is an altar blessing ritual kit. And then I think... Okay, I hope... Actually, I think I'll open this part now. No, I don't want to rip it. How do I... How do I open it without ripping it? No. Is there a way to remove the sticker? Am I supposed to peel the sticker? Yes, I'm supposed to peel the sticker. Okay. I was an idiot, and now I feel bad because I slightly ripped it. Um, oh, okay. So this is a self-power empowerment ritual. Um, cute. Okay, okay. I got this when I do spell work more often because I'm kind of lazy about it. Okay, so this is a ritual tile. I know, I'm going all out of order. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that's actually really cute the way that they did this one. Because I have some ritual tiles as it is. Um, but this one's definitely got nicer engraving. Or at least just... I mean, it's nice. Like, I really like the weight of it. Okay, and this is a witch casket exclusive. So this must be the candle probably, right? Right? What is this? Oh, no, no, no. This is a little, what is this? Spell casting candle holder. So it's like the tiniest butt pan I've ever seen, but it has legs. I be honest, I don't do enough spell work to really know what half the stuff is for. Um, because I 
am lazy and do... Oh my god, why is this ritual bowl so adorable? Why does it match? It matches my little house. It matches. Like, look at the color of purples. Okay, it's not a perfect match, but it's definitely like a dusty kind of like classy kind of pastel kind of, you know, like cottage core, like, you know, like it aged with fine wine. I don't know. Okay, so some spell candles, which, um, considering that the only ones I have are like ones that my mom gave me, this is actually pretty nice. Now I can, uh, say that I paid for some. So they gave a purple, a green, and a black. And I'm guessing that these actually fit in here. Yeah, they do. Okay. So that will catch the excess wax so you don't make a mess, um, which is actually really important with uh, candles. These stick candles is making sure you have a good candle holder, which I thrift them all the time just for funsies. But I know not everyone does. Um, so this is an incense. Um, I've never been the greatest fan of incense, but that's just because they bother, like, me personally. Um, oh, God, how do I open this? So, it's got two, so I open that side first. Okay, I'm mangling this box a little bit. Yeah, so it's just some long stick incense. Of, I guess the standard variety. I'm just not too familiar with stick incense. So this is one of the first times that I'm looking at them. You know, you get like a fair bit amount of them in here, actually. Does not feel like you... I don't know. I'm, I'm used to like needing to know what I'm ordering because I can't trust companies to actually send you like decent stuff. What do you mean I get a magic wand? Okay, why do I feel like I'm in Hogwarts right now? And I know that that's controversial to say. It came in this really nice, like, box. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. I, I didn't really have a magic wand. I had been thinking about getting one of these crystal ones for, like, a long time. And I didn't do it. Um, You know, like, the ones made with crystal and hot glue. You know. <laughs> I didn't do it, and now I have this one, and you know what? I'm very, very happy to have a little magic wand. Yay! Okay, so now we're getting on to the last few things. Okay, okay, so this is the little tumbled stone. It comes with a little card that tells you how to, like, what it's used for, and it's, um, it's mostly green, but it's a piece of rainbow fluorite. It's got a little bit of purple, hence why I know it's rainbow fluorite. Um, it's really pretty. A little egg-shaped. Very nice. Um, so I think there's just two more things left. So let's go ahead and get to the ritual blessing kit and see what's in here. I don't know why I'm like trying not to rip this one because it's definitely going to rip. Uh, no, I was able to get the sticker off. No can't, no problems. So, first there's a white candle. There's also some little pieces of clear quartz in there. Um, oh, gosh, there's definitely herbs in here. Definitely herbs. So, so, okay, so number one is mint, and number two is dill weed. Okay, so, I was given herbs. I have herbs now, like, like a real witch, um, but yeah, it's got a little altar, uh, blessing ritual, which is very, very nice to have in January. I'm kind of glad that I got this at this time. And now let me start, well, end off on the last thing, which is the enamel pen of the month. Oh my gosh, she's such a beauty. And, um, let me just poke her on out of there but yeah oh my gosh I finally get to start a pin collection I always get afraid but yay I'm so excited yay. so pretty 
Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.